This arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, a woman is looking for a bigger apartment. Right now, she lives in a small studio apartment that is in the shape of a square. She finds an apartment that has twice the area of her current apartment. If the perimeter of her current apartment is 100 feet, how many square feet is the new apartment? So let's start with the fact that this woman currently lives in a studio apartment that's in the shape of a square. You may recall that squares have side lengths that are all equal, and we refer to the side length of a square using the letter, letter variable s. What's more, uh, you have to know some basic formulas for the ASVAB and PICAT. More specifically, you have to know how to calculate the perimeter and area of a square. Perimeter is four times s, and the area is going to be s squared. That said, we also know that the perimeter of her current apartment is 100 feet. So I can go ahead and plug in 100 for P over here. This becomes 100 equals 4S. If I divide both sides by 4 now, this crosses out, leaving, with, leaving me with S over here. 100 divided by 4 is 25. So I know this side length is 25. And now that I know that side length is 25, I can now find the area of her current apartment because I can plug in 25 for S. This becomes 25 squared. And um, so as not to make a mistake, I'm going to do this math off to the side. 25 squared is the same thing as 25 times 25. Uh, 5 times 5 is 25. Bring down a 5, carry a 2. 5 times 2 is 10. Plus 2 is 12. Add a 0 placeholder. Uh, 2 times 5 is 10. Bring down a 0, carry a 1. 2 times 2 is 4. Plus 1 is going to be 5. This becomes 5, 2, 6. So the area of her current apartment is 625 square feet. We know that the area of the new apartment is going to be twice the area of her current apartment. So that's going to be 625 times 2. 5 times 2 is 10. Bring down a 0, carry a 1. 2 times 2 is 4, plus 1 is 5. 6 times 2 is 12. So the area of the new apartment is going to be C, 1,250 square feet.